guys, what is up? It is Astounding Magic here, and thank you for tuning in today because I am going to be showing you how to record your iOS 9 screen. Now, a very, very, very common screen recorder that people had before iOS 9 came out was something called Shell. Now, unfortunately, iOS 9 is lock that and now shell is not compatible with iOS 9. So I've got a method for you guys on how to still record your iOS 9 screen to come out with great iOS 9 or iOS videos. This is a problem if people want to create um, videos showing their iOS device screen. So let's head right to my computer in three, two, one, now, okay, hello, I am on my computer screen. Now, um, what you are going to want to do is you want to go into Safari or Google Chrome or Internet Explorer, anything, and you want to search Reflector 2. Not Reflect 2, Reflector 2, just like this. And it's going to be this link right over here. Um, yeah, this one right over here. Um, Reflector 2, Mac Features, Mirror, Stream, Record, and more. If you're on Windows, it won't say Mac Features and give you all those features. But you um, want to go into that, and I'll put the link in the description below for that. So when you go on to this uh, website, you want to um, click either if you're on Mac, Windows, or Android, um, or Amazon Fire TV. You want to click click that. Um, now, it, you can just do the um, trial version. Or you can buy it for 15 bucks, which isn't much, and it's pretty good um, to remove the watermark as well. You can buy it. Um, it's a one-off thing. It's pretty it's worth it for the 15 bucks. I haven't at the moment because I'm still trying with it. Um, but you basically, as you can see over here, now mirror with iOS 9, which is, which is nice. So you can do updated UI, you can mirror, you can do recordings, you can do streamings, you can do security. Um, and these are the two apps you can download on your iOS or Android device. So this is basically what's going to look like in the interface. Um, and this is for Android users only. So I'm right over here. So it's really nice, you can upload your video straight to YouTube, but um, so you want to click download when you've got your thing over here. So you've got for Mac or for Windows, so you want to click download because I am on Mac and it will open a link right over here. Um, and then, yeah, so if I click on that, um, you can see it right over there. Um, but I'm going to just cancel that because I've already downloaded it, so you, I don't need to download it again, obviously. So let's go right into this app. There it is on my desktop, right over there, Reflector 2. So, um, when we open this app, well, let's just see what's going to come on. So this is what it's going to look like when you go on the um, app. It's going to come up to with Welcome to Reflector 2. Um, my trial actually does expire in four days. So you can choose to purchase it or try it. Or if you have a license key, just put that license key in. So when you click Try Reflector 2, what's going to happen is, depending if you're on a Windows or Mac, if you're on a Windows, it's going to pop up on your um, menu bar 
it's going to be like a little triangle thing. You click that and it shows the icons and start recording. But if you're on a Mac, I will show you what happens. What's going to happen is basically on your um, menu bar at the top. don't know if you can see that well, but if I click it, it's going to come up with my name right over here. Um, and basically what you want to do is on your iOS device, when you turn it on, um, you want to swipe up from the bottom and you will see this little airplay option yeah. right over there and you want it should come up with your computer's name is that the focus i don't think it's going to focus but you want to click your name or your computer's name and it's going to ask you an option to mirror and over here you'll see and sorry for the noise in the background if you look um when you swipe down from the bottom to the top you will see this little thing um connecting to my mac and you've got the option to turn mirror on or off and as you can see this is what it's going to look like. So this is my iPad screen. It automatically detects what type of iOS device or Android device it is. So it's going to come up with that nice outside banner. But that's basically it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment and subscribe for more. Um, if this helped you out, trying to find a way to record your um, iOS screen, that is great. Um, forgot to show you one thing. Um, there is a little option for recording right over there. So as you can see, I can just basically record the screen. I can tell it to stop and it will start finishing, loading the recording. Um, but yeah, that's, that's basically it. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Astounding Magic, out.